Hey everybody. Okay, y'all, let's get into the kitchen because we're about to make Hey everybody, what's popping on me on Saturday? Okay, I have to get that out of the way. Everybody say hey, 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 how you doing? Hey friend, hey friend, hey friend, hey best friend. Girl, you already know I can go live. I just didn't do it yesterday because I was uh, trying to clean up my house and, you know, stuff like that. I've just been real, real busy lately. I don't know. Let me just clean up. Hey, everybody. So, hope y'all can still kind of see me. We're about to make some uh, copycat in and out sauce real quick. So, I'm about to chop up some pickles because I do not have any, um, What's that stuff called? Oh shit. Chop with some pickles because I don't have any relish yet. If I do, I'm gonna just use fresh pickles instead. about three. No, I'll just do it in three. Okay. You want to got my air fryer on? Hopefully y'all can see this, right? follow me on snapchat or instagram i do have a table haul to do with a lot a lot of stuff so i'm gonna try to do that tonight i was gonna do that first but i'm like i didn't want to um have my clothes smell like fucking food Whatever size I like, I'm gonna do like two medium, small, small. What y'all cooking for dinner? Y'all eating out or what? Weekend, I think we might go get us a drink or a mar margarita or something. Oh, matter of fact, I think I'm about to do a self care day because I need it. Okay, so I got my hey Gemini, I got my pickles cut up to whatever I like it. I mean, this would be my if it got me not wanting to eat. Girl, yes, but the key thing is, hey, bestie, the key thing is, is to actually eat. Because if you don't eat, you're just going to gain the weight back. You know what I mean? I mean, you're not going to lose nothing. Okay, so I got my... Girl, Virgo, don't say that. Don't say that. I think I just got hung out enough what I'm about to eat, but I'm not cooking. I know that's right. So I got my, what you call it in here? Let's get us ketchup. Let's 
and we like Miracle Whip in this house. We don't do um, Hellman's Mayo or you know whatever. Girl, yes, use pickles. I cannot do um, tuna without relish or anything. So we're just gonna mix this up. And the reason why we're doing this first is so we can put it into the refrigerator because my pickles have been on my counter. It's a fresh bottle. Y'all wonder if I should season this stomach. I don't know if In and Out seasons they um stuff. Yeah, not, I don't know if I told y'all, but I got my um, I got my uh, sweet potato fries in the air fryer right now. That way, it can all kind of be done at the same time. So that's how it should look. If y'all make coffee cake in our sauce, what else do y'all be putting in y'all's um, sauce? Six minutes because I like mine crunchy. I don't like them a little Perfect. Thank you so much.
Okay, I'm going to put on my gloves. So I kind of like a little cut trying to get this griddle out. And y'all know I do not like touching raw hamburger meat. I don't know, the texture is just like. And I would have made a turkey burger for me, but I'm just like, I don't know. I don't think I've never seen nobody make a smashed turkey burger. Like, you know what I mean? So I just bought a little small thing of um, hamburger meat. Everybody, I only have two packs of shrimp left. Girl, Virgo, when I tell you go to Walmart because they have um, colossal shrimp for seven dollars. That's already paid. Um, pain. That's already uh, deveined and peeled, baby. When I tell you, I had some boiled eggs, them shrimp. I made my own little. Uh, seafood sauce. I just did um, garlic, onion powder, um, obey, some butter, and I chopped up some fresh fresh garlic, and I put some red pepper flakes in there, and I squeezed just a little, little, little bit of lemon juice in there, put it on the stove, you know, let it look, you know, sizzle. I put my eggs and my um, hot wing sausage inside the pot, and I let them boil, and then I cleaned my pot out, put some fresh water in there, had my water come to a boil and I just put my shrimp in there so they can uh, just steam or boil whatever baby it is the best I'm just like when I go to Walmart I'm about to stock my deep freezer up cause girl that was the best shit happening ever hey Barbara and when I tell you that it was way cheaper than going to the seafood place cause last time I went to the seafood place I felt like my shrimp was you know overdone and it was like mushy and I was just like no. Let me see. These are the hot wing sausages I got from the um, the butcher. So baby, when it comes in a pack like this, you know you're in good hands. them from uh, from the butcher and I don't have a uh, mini shrimp bowl with them and I don't have them for um, for breakfast so I'm just like girl put you one or two of them get things inside the um, boiling water with some boiled eggs with a little salt and pepper now that is the old school breakfast right here for you okay let me see if y'all can bend down so I went on and patted out my burgers. Like I said, my package was like this small. Um, it was like this small, so I'm like, it wasn't a lot of meat. Like I said, I want to do smash burgers. I don't know if I told you, like after we went to, uh, we left the hospital, we went to um, Shake Shack for the first time. So I'm gonna turn my griddle on. And then I also have some, what was that? I also have some, smoked thick cut bacon or whatever from the butcher and I just sliced them in half um it's I cut them in half so we're gonna each have like three pieces a piece I just chopped them up in half so that way I can do a crisscross section my seasonings that's in this blend I have um black pepper onion garlic powder um Tony's and Y'all gonna be so proud of me. I feel like I just turned my thing down. Y'all know how I said I don't be cooking with salt. So last time I was in Walmart, I got Daniel's Spicy. Um, it has no salt in it. Cause I seen everybody was using this on TikTok. And then, um, well, I, I guess I can't say plus size Barbie because her name is Shayon Say Love in her and like a lot of other people were telling me to get Mrs. Dash so I'm like this is the one that I got 
Um, I do like these two, so I'm like, I will go back and get um, the other ones. I think I'll wait on this one, so I'm like, it is a lot. I mean, it's the whole thing, so I won't go back and get the, they do have an original, but I got the spicy. And then I'll just go back and go get some different type of Mrs. Dash. And I got these for $1.25, so this is what we're about to eat now today. So I'm like, hopefully y'all can see me. Is this a good angle or what? I stayed with Miss Dash in my cabinet, try the yellow bottle. I'm going to have to go back to Walmart because I have put everybody on... Well, actually, they was at work, and I was just like, who brought these in? But we had got them in an order. These wipes right here. Baby, these things smell so good. Hey, Aaliyah. And I found out that they have Swiffer, Swiffer wipes. I found out they have Swiffer wipes. Um... So, let me put my bacon on first, and then I also cut up some whole onions. So I'm going to grill the whole onion just like that. Y'all feel like it's fucking hot as shit right now. Oh, there we go. That's a much better angle. I could have easily put this in the air fryer, but I was like, you know what? Y'all can't even see me cook, so that's what we about to do. Oh, turn my fan off so that way it doesn't, um, what you call it? It doesn't go off. Put this on like between 250 and 300. Keep a little of the bacon grease grill. It's in here because you know I'm about to do it with my onions. That's exactly why I did it. Okay, so here's how thin my patties are. Real thin. I was getting there about to make six burgers out of each one. But some powers. Yeah. But I think I'm going to do him a, um, I'm going to ask him if he wants a triple burger or a double. Because I didn't take nothing else to cook tomorrow. So I'm like, he's going to be kind of on his own and so am I. So, Maybe I'll take something out and um, do it. But I'm going to just take my spice blend. And I'm going to season these up real, real good because you need to season both sides. Yeah. 
We're going to flip it and do it the other side. Y'all, you know the reason why I made me do this, like I said, we want to uh, smash burger, but Bun B just opened his little trill burger in uh, Texas, and girl, it makes me want to go to Texas just to try because of the packaging and the way it looks. We can save the rest of this for the onions, you know what I mean? Take this one off. I'm trying to have plenty more. Damn, I didn't see nothing else there. Um, Yolanda, my seasoning is onion, garlic powder, dano, spicy, salt free, Mrs. Dash, onion, and I think it's garlic and herb, and I have some Tony's uh, Creole seasoning there. Hey J Sparkles, um, hey Lachey, keep a little of the bacon grease to add, you know it. Hey Kenya, <laughs> girl I'm already ahead of you, you already know. Like I said, when I be cooking, I really, uh, I prep so that everything will go a little bit faster. And y'all ain't waiting on a, um, okay. So here's our bacon. Well, let me start down here and flip. Well, they don't need to be flipped just you. Everybody, what's going on? What's up, Ace Goose family? Next time you cook, smash burgers, just use salt and pepper. That's all you need, and it brings out the flavor you need. You know what? I will do that next time, but I'm gonna be eating burgers. Well, I should say, I don't want to cook burgers at home. I like to eat my burgers from somewhere else. I feel like they do it better. Hey Hazel, hey pretty girl Shay, this special Shay thing is still on liquid so I kill for one of the burgers. Girl, congratulations. Good luck on your new journey. Yeah, I went to the doctor Wednesday and um, I lost eight pounds as y'all already know. But I think I was just trying to get into the room. Well, I lost eight pounds and uh, um, as y'all know, well, y'all probably don't know, but I think what's best for me is to, um, do this and have the weight loss surgery. So, that's what I'm going for. And I have an appointment July 14th or something like that. Yeah, I have an appointment July 14th to uh, talk to the people or whatever. Oh, shit. Let's turn it down. I feel like my thing's going to come on. July 14th. And I was asking for the scale because I'm like, I just chose to have an a, a at-home Zoom appointment. You know, it's just to talk to whatever. You know, they just want to know my accurate weight um, or whatever. Um, what else? So I've been on the, the 0.5, yeah, I think it's the 0.5. Well, I've been on the lowest dosage of Ozempic and then I just got my refill like last week or something like that. And so when I went to the doctor this time, she put in an order for my third month to go up a dose. So that's my next thing is to hunt for that other dose. But I'm gonna finish out the lowest dosage and then I'm gonna be moving up 
And you are Yolanda. Girl, save that date. But yeah, I just think that's best for me because you know, PCO play PCOS plays a big part. Uh, my genetics. Like I really do not have none of my mama things. Like as y'all can see, me on my daddy's side. But all my sisters are like heavyweight, but I'm like they're not as heavy as me. But I'm just like you know we could all you know lose a couple pounds. But I'm just like rather than that, everybody else is fit than me. So. I'm doing what's best for me. I know a lot of people are just like, I don't agree with people having surgery, that, that, this, and that. Well, sorry, home skillet. You do what you have to do. And I know it's going to be totally, totally different when ever stuff, you know, hits the fan and it gets to that point. But I think right now, with me being on the shot, you know, like I feel confident in it, you know? Like I'm not constantly like, trying to avoid myself or you know stop myself from eating or whatever you know my like, you can eat what you want to eat just eat it in moderation and don't go overboard so when y'all see me make some cookies last night i had a half a cookie and a little cup of milk and i'm like that was it you know what i mean so i'm just like i know not to sit there and eat all six cookies or just because i cooked six you know i ate all you know three you know splitting down the middle you know what i mean I know. I know a lot of us like, girl, don't be eating them cookies. You know, you, um, don't be eating them cookies. You know, you lost eight pounds. You know, like, don't do it. And I'm like, it's okay. I'm like, I know my limits. I'm like, I'm going to, uh, Shoot, I wasn't gonna give up that bad. I'm gonna give up that series, you know what I mean? Right, baby, we know. Okay, so I don't know how y'all like y'all bacon, but I like my bacon well done, but I'm like, I will say, like, I do like a little bit of fat on it. So I'm gonna go ahead and take these off. Let this one cook a little bit longer. Yeah. I'm like, don't give up on me so easily now. And so, since I got my grease on here, I'm just going to throw these bad boy onions on here because I know I love my onions. Leslie, you can come on over here and get a burger if you want to. You can come get one. Okay, you know what? Well, one day I'm going to just have a uh, a little pop-up shop and I'm going to just pull up and just start cooking. So when I tell you I'm sitting at Walmart parking lot, at the end where nobody be parking at, and y'all just see me over there flipping something, you better come on over and get one because it's gonna be gone. I'm trying to tell you now.
For our cheese, we're going to use two American slices, and then we have some sliced with cheese and baby. We're going to use this Hawaiian bread. This is the one y'all told me to get, so this is what we're about to use. Oh, I think y'all might. Do a change of fun for it. Yeah, you don't even really feel it, and I be putting it in my stomach. I don't do it that. It doesn't make me have uh, bad side effects. The only time I ever get nausea is when I haven't eaten all day, and it's like, you know, like when you get jittery, like you need, you know, like something to eat, or you know, like some little piece of candy or something. Smashing on the griddle. I want to smash this because I really want some of that um, some crispy edges like they be doing. I'm 63 years old, I've gained so much, but I don't look in the mirror and take pictures. Dude, that's alright. We're, we're going to fix that. I think one of these mornings, I'm going to, um, I'm going to go live and go live for probably like 30 minutes, 20 minutes, and we're just going to walk the track. Like, I'm going to just get on there and tell y'all, hey, Monique, it's bright and early. We're going to just walk the track, and we're just going to get our little 20, 30 minutes in for the day. Like I said, I'm still debating about getting a Planet Fitness, because I'm just like, I don't want to be paying money that I'm not, something that I'm not going to go to, because I'm just like, me, I'm like, I'd rather just go to Walmart or, you know, go somewhere specifically shopping and walk around in there and that way you know I can get my steps in or you know at least bust a sweat you know doing something that I still feel like that is fun and it interests me me walking around a track, tra track or in the gym doesn't interest me at all like it makes it feel like it's some type of um, chore or something you know just like just like um you know, like the older people go to, they walk around the mall, like they be power walking the mall, but I'm just like, shoot, I can go to the mall and just window shopping. Y'all might see me there every day. And especially if I catch a sale, say a back and body work got a sale for this day, and then you come back and go to the next one. Okay. I know back and body work is at the end of the mall. 
let me park in the front so that way I can walk to go get my my treat or you know my celebration for the day and then when I get it I'm gonna walk back to my car and be happy you know I'm not gonna feel like yeah I'm like I got to get up and do this you know every day until my body gets used to it or my mind gets used to it then I can be like you know what let me go work out today like it's gonna you know be more enjoyment you know the more you do it the more you're gonna enjoy it right now I'm just like I don't know if I want to spend the money to go look at everybody who's already freaking fit in my eyes or you know whatever the case may be oh maybe it's an onion just like when, I, when I'm in work I'm like I could easily tell my clients hey go throw this in the trash can or do this or whatever you know I'm just like now I'm like I'm gonna just get up and you know go do it myself you know I mean they still do stuff you know to keep them independent and you know stuff like that but I'm like there's certain stuff that you know I'm like I can just do it myself or like I used to do like a whole bunch of uh Walmart orders but I'm just like now baby I'm gonna go to Walmart I'm like, I'm just gonna go on in there. Let's put these good things over. I think this one was a little too early. I'm gonna try to eat. Let's see what I can do. We're praying for you to eat. These are some of the way of getting stuff. Yeah, it's either getting a gym membership or I'm about to buy a treadmill. Putting them photo books for my living room. Oh, congratulations, Passion. Girl, I know that Kiki is looking amazing on you. I'm going for surgery Monday for my kidney stone thing. Oh, we're praying for you, Steve. Girl. Girl, come get your plate. No cap. Now I need to see some press on these burgers. I didn't turn it all, all the way up so we don't see now. I've been trying to work up with my kidney stones and trying I know it's it's definitely a struggle, but I mean at least you trying it, you know, you getting it you getting it done. Kinda of think I want my onions like this to grow them a little bit more. Well especially that one too. Baby, just imagine these burgers on a steak. I mean, these onions on a steak. Let me go and break this and try they kind of big. My grandma and so for this image, but people said I'm going to have something and it's just to stop the food. You know, there's no problem about food all day. I don't have to eat you in this medication. Um, I just, um, yeah, I mean, I've also heard that too, that some people like, when you're all better than Ozempic, but to as long as you can get your medication that you need to help you and everything, girl, the doctor even told me my little BMI went down. I was just like, maybe that's what I'm talking about. That's what we need. You would think that since this medication is so high in demand that they would put their little scientists or doctors to work. 
I mean, this is a $1,200 medication and I'm paying my insurance to pay y'all, which I still have to come out of pocket both ways. Y'all need to start working. Oh, G family, that is hella good. So I'm just like, whatever they need to do to um, get it done, that's what they need to do to get it done. Like, what are y'all going to work for? You know what I mean? Like, get it together. Obviously, you see it's helping a lot of people. And some people are willing to pay that $1,200 if their insurance don't cover or if they don't have insurance. So, I mean, what are you going to do? Okay, I'm going to slide my burgers over. Let me just toast my bread on here. We're going to see how it go first. You know what, I've never been a, a, a sweet person. Like, I love to just eat food. Like, don't ask me if I want no cake, no nothing like that. And I'm like, obviously, I had to try my own creation last night, but I'm like, that's pretty much it for me. Now, I will be going to the, um, Damn, I went to right to Dollar Tree, give me the book. But you know how Dollar Tree has those um, baskets? Like Dollar Tree already has the baskets. So that's when I'm gonna um, go back and get, cause I'm like, I used to have some, but I'm like, I don't know where. Ooh, toasting pretty good. Toasting pretty good. Okay. I think we never about to make a daddy meal. Okay, let me go ahead. I eat less as a taller meal. You know what, G family, and I also learned that freaking get a kid's meal. Because a kid's meal is dead ass freaking really fulfilling. And sometimes the kid's meal is almost a little, you know, not like a little much for me just to write it now. But I might get filled before you even finish the kid's meal. You know what I mean? I'm gonna just do it like this and put this little stuff on top. Cause I told babe we was out one day and we was out one day and we had been running errands and stuff like that. So you know we was just like when I tell somebody like I need a snack, like when I say I need a snack, I don't need a full course meal. Like when I say I want a snack, I want me like a little five dollar holly, you know little chicken nugget, you know, a little this, you know, a little that. But I'm like, girl, he went in there. I told him to give me a six-piece um, kids' meals, you know, and it came with a, uh, the little small little fry, and it came with some apple slices. And let me turn my bread because I feel like I'm about to burn it. Let me turn this down because I feel like it's toasting. And, um, yeah, so baby, when I tell you that I had the little six piece nugget with the, um, the fries and the apple spices and my little drink, baby, I was full of the tick. I was full of the tick. And I was just like, damn, like, I was like, damn, like, how much did this, uh, let me go ahead and make him a triple, that's a small ass burger. I was just like, damn, how much did that even freaking cost? I'm just like, Maybe I can be saving so much money like when I go out or whatever. So 
So I learned that I can get a kid's meal and be happy and satisfied. And also, you know, like you can go to like a place, um, you know, like you can go to a place and, you know, they say, you know, you can get um, a meat plus two sides. So we had went to, um, actually Big Baby had told us, um, showed us this little place. Cause I was like, you know what? I was like, I wouldn't mind being off on a Sunday one day. So then that way, you know, like I can, you know, do like my self care, um, reset, you know, like clean my house, cook, uh, you know, dinner and stuff like that. But I'm like, shoot, I want somebody to cook for me. So what I did was we went to this place and baby, when I tell you I got chicken, macaroni and yams and baby got he got a uh, meatloaf green beans and mashed potatoes we shared all that and baby i was full i didn't even finish eating my food and i gave him the rest and he still had food i don't know it just made me think like I bitch really don't even need all this fucking food. I'm just being fucking fat and greedy. But hold on. Damn, I forgot that you want this close on me. Oh, let me turn it off because I'm like, it's done. My bad, I didn't mean to leave that like that. Okay. <gasps> I forgot to put my bacon on there. Well, you know what? It can fail next. I'm like, it's turned off. Let's see if you like this sauce, if you want some of it. G family, I feel you. I'm not gonna sleep with hair fryers. Oh,
okay, y'all. Baby said he wants me to talk to him. I don't know if you really like onions like me. I was going to save my turkey, but look at your mom should make making it too. Girl, you better quit playing. Quit playing, girl. Now I'm gonna take me some parking paper and I'm gonna wrap it up. If y'all do not know who um Quan Tran is on YouTube, y'all need to go look him up because I feel like I'm like the female version of him. Now I'm freaking trying to get this out of the freaking cabinet. I scraped my whole freaking um thumb. And I sat right there and said, you know what? I need a bigger kitchen. Like it's I need a bigger kitchen. Oh I maybe I can um put the light up here. Uh, I should have had my ring light. for y'all. Girl, my man ain't ate all day and he went to work. Yeah, he deserve a burger. And I guarantee he won't even finish this. He'll come back for some three times. He'll come back three or four times before he finish it. And also he uh will leave like the smallest fucking bite. Like somebody's gonna take his last bite. Y'all, should we cut it diagonal or should we cut it right down the middle? What's y'all's name? Diagonal or right down the middle? One 
somebody that would be done. Dang. Diagonal. How long? So which one we doing? Diagonal or down the middle? Right now, I think I got about two for two. I got two diagonals, one middle. You know what? I'll do his down the middle and I'll do mine diagonal. Boom. That's the whole point of uh, cooking for two, baby. Cheese is not even melty enough. Like, what are you doing? I'm gonna get a portrait of this one. Now he's gonna get a bag of chips. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's all we got left. One more free though. So that's his dinner. Cause I need a big boy. I need a big boy. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I don't think this is doing enough. Let me be a little bit more extra. I did have some lettuce and tomatoes, but baby, we was not going for that tonight. Then we're gonna come back to do my dad. Welcome. Now come on, Mumbo, let's fix your mommy's plate. I'll call you on back. Now let's do shape base plate. Try like a little cheese skirt down here. I got the two small buggies. Oh, look at that! Look at that! That's the best part right there.
Y'all, I have never been in love so much with um, freaking sweet potato fries. Like, I don't know. I always see people try them. Like, you know what? I'm going to try them. And I'm like, I absolutely love them. Like, I can eat sweet potato fries by itself for a fucking snack and grilled some chicken. If somebody don't hire me to be in their kitchen, matter of fact, you ain't gotta hire me. I'ma just <laughs> open up my own shit. Should um you should definitely go go get you some. Hey Didi. Girl, my mom she eats sweet potatoes like by herself. Like you know how people like might get like a bowl of ice cream? She gets a uh, sweet potato. Walmart. Back when I got the real Walmart, it's $20. Yeah, I said I was going to buy me some, um, some special, um, wax paper, parking paper. Okay, right, so let me go ahead and use what I got first. Then I'm gonna find some on Amazon. I did like this. I do got my um. Hey everybody, I do got my um my French fry holders in there. So I could put them in there. But y'all go ahead and take the first bite. Some of y'all been waiting all the You know, need the paper. Um. They don't see them. How was it, baby? It was good. 
Mama, I should have made you a little burger. You got the bacon on there, the onion. I'm surprised you like the sauce, babe. You say you surprised I liked it. Yeah. Mm. Okay, now usually you just do the regular stuff. Boy, y'all better hope I do this tea move all tonight. Not really, I guess we've just been telling everybody. He don't like sweet potato fries. I don't got no sweet potato fries. He just got chips. Diddy. Okay, hold on. Girl, I thought you were talking about a link to the uh, thing. Okay, my bad. Okay, I'm about to post this link right here. So this is Cooking with Didi and she's in a competition. She made it to the top 10 or the top 20. And I need y'all to go and vote for her. Um, you don't have to pay anything. You can literally sign through Facebook and it's just to verify who you are and give her a vote so that way she can win. So I'm about to post the link right now. As you can see, I voted today. I've been voting every day. Um, the other day they had double, double um, vote. But y'all, let's support this queen and go and vote for her. Yeah. What's her name? Didi. Go, Didi. Ooh. So let me go ahead and copy the link right now. Yes, you see. Let me, um, dang. Let me go ahead and post it. Oh. Diddy, I'm gonna have to pin it in the comments because it's too uh it's too many characters. Uh how do I do the regular one? Damn. I don't think I can uh damn. Okay. 
Okay. Diddy, whenever I get off live, I'm going to pin it to the actual, um, the actual comments because it's not letting me um, post it because it's too many characters. How long did he, um, I don't think you can share the link. See if you can share the link so I, I can at least uh, pin it in this, uh, I can pin it in the, the chat. Yes, I'm about to do it right now. Damn, no one, this is a big ass wink. So how can I get the picture then? How long can I do it now? Oh, are you in sixth place? All right, I did it. When you win, you owe me a plate. Yeah, the post is up. Go vote for DD. Okay. Y'all, I don't mind doing stuff like this. You know how people be charging people and stuff like that? Baby, I don't want everybody to win. Because I ain't no hater. Girl, I just want to eat my fries now. It's on the community tab. It might not have posted yet. It's on there because I got on my other account to see. It's on there. Now I'm going to take the other half for tomorrow. I can 
save that one for um for lunch tomorrow for it. And then I'll just call me something else for dinner. Or or I may keep that for dinner and put me some more sweet potato fries with it. And Yeah, I already posted it. Girl, I hope you do win. No more, I don't got nothing. It's gone. Y'all, that was a good laugh. Oh, she said she's gonna be on TV in a competition. Um. Diddy, whenever they have um, your know, show, like if they have like a live audience or something like that, let me know like ahead, ahead of time because you know like y'all be doing stuff now and then like your shows like a year later or you know whatever. Let me know so I can, you know, try to, you know, book me a ticket or something, you know, be in a live audience. I'm like, oh my God. Girl, Diddy has been a fan of me. She's been in the palace for a long time. Girl, this queen can cook her ass off girl and when you get up there I'm gonna need you to show the fuck out give it to all when they say you didn't see good enough no they can't say that because they may told you it ain't season if you ain't season okay so baby remember what I taught you and you know remember what you taught me you feel me oh wait mm-hmm G family you already know what it is that's that code gonna do it Girl, yeah, let me know ahead of time. Cause girl, you know I am. Girl, I'm gonna get a whole shirt with Diddy's face on it. <laughs> <laughs> a whole last picture. Y'all child, now the worst part about this is cleaning up. And I'm like, at least I can clean up as I go. Over there, start like that. Okay, one, two, three, go. <laughs> you know she's scared to go downstairs. So period. Y'all, he trying to wash my clothes so I can fold them up. And I'm like, I don't want to do no laundry. He washes clothes and I fold them. Girl, when I tell you he loves to wash clothes, he be washing a little too damn much sometimes. Girl, God bless you all for voting for me and don't forget to vote every day. Girl, she's adamant about that vote every day. They told me to come back in 24 hours. Oh, man. Y'all put the thing took a shower and get my makeup and stuff. We come on. They take a nap with me. So Tyler took a nap, then cooked him and ate. Now, we need to get something done. My shoes still stuff ain't came yet. said that one cup with Bobby Flay. Girl, and Bobby Flay better not win because I think he be cheating sometimes. And I'm like, Bobby Flay, your stuff is not always seasoned and then you want to do something extra. Stick
Respect what you know. Baby, one more time. No, I'm gonna show you the face. Uh, whatever. Watch out. <laughs> oh, there you go. Mm -hmm. Oh, do it, do it. Look, y'all. Look, y'all. <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, you <laughs> they didn't see nothing. <laughs> For a person who said they didn't like the cookies, you should have smashed them. I don't like them. You talking to me? Yeah, you. I said, for a person who said you didn't like some cookies, you should have smashed them. Mm-hmm. You look too tired to go home tomorrow. Girl, I work 12 hours tomorrow, 10 to 10. Now, I mean, I could, uh, I mean, I could, um, I could freaking, um, I don't know, it's just about freaking taking, <laughs> girl, he ain't got no haircut. I would have, you know, turned to the back of my thing and okay, you know, beat beef is all out of there. But I'm like, I would freaking, um, do the try on hall, hall part first. I'm just like, girl, I got to freaking go take a shower. Freaking, I got to do my makeup and setting up the freaking camera. And I'm like, now I got to charge my phone. I'm going to charge my iPad. Freaking do my makeup and then change clothes. I think I probably got about five outfits myself. And then Mr. Man has like two shirts. And then I got freaking two pairs of shoes like she down here on the floor thinking I'm gonna drop a big ass piece of burger she just had steak and filet me on or something so yeah that would be one part because they won't make two uh separate videos and then I got a lot of um like smaller things so I'm just like I mean, you could have half the rest of my half of my burger. I mean, it's right here. So, yeah, he is handsome. He just chocolate is a little black to feel. But yeah, so I'm just like, mm, maybe I maybe I might do part. Usually, I just go ahead and get the charm off. Or maybe I'll be done Monday or something, so at least I can wear a cute dress or something to work. You know. So is Timo still cheap after your first order? Uh, yeah. Cause my mom was gonna order from there, and I think she probably had like a hundred and ninety dollars worth of stuff, and she used my coupon code, and it took twenty five dollars off. Um, but then she went back and added more stuff, so I'm just like, girl, I don't know. But I'm trying to tell you, I mean, the stuff is super cheap, and when I tell you, like, the stuff is very useful when I tell you I've got two packs of eyelashes now when I shop I think about stuff that I'm actually going to use and actually like what I need for my house I done got clothes I done got um bathroom accessories kitchen stuff um girl I done actually got something for my living room right now um I just gotta, I'm gonna just have to show y'all as is but I'm gonna have to go to Michael's or somewhere and look for like some picture frames for it. But maybe they kind of in. So when I tell you that I laid everything out on my couch and like separated it by category so that I can be like, okay, this is gonna be one gift and this is gonna be the other one. Uh what you want? You the one with the uh with the big boy toy now. I could get caught in that two little trap. Girl, it ain't a trap. I'm just think it is an investment. A real investment. Um, I would say sizing is true to size, but I've been getting my stuff to like the biggest size and I noticed that um some of it is too big. Like one of these outfits I have right now, like I don't know, like I don't like the material because it's like strictly uh polyester.
But yeah, so I'm I'm gonna do it, and I'm like, then I got this freaking snack box, and I'm just like, my shit gonna be one bite, and that's it. Oh, I gotta do that. That's three videos. I think I'm gonna do a self care day where I'm actually gonna, you know, I don't know. We just gonna just do whatever. I don't know. Oh, so anybody trying to rub your back? Yeah, and I'm just like, shoot, I need to freaking do some videos so I'm like, I can wear my braids. I'm like, I literally been wearing them in the bun and I only wore them down twice. Once the other day and, yeah, once the other day and, um, what was it? Yeah, on Monday, because I didn't have to drive girl. Girl, yeah, had to bring that little dress back out. You know what I mean? Oh, I'm planning to be making a little thumbnail for that one. Mm. So, girl, yeah. Yeah. I look damn good, you know what I mean? But yeah, so I'm like, I could get started right now. I mean, it's only 7.30, so I'm like, I eat before 8 o'clock. The weather right now is pretty hot. I mean, it's decent. Okay, running up, and I think you do more shorts on here. You, is that, girl, you know what? So, I found out that when I post, like, a story, it lasts for, like, a whole week. And somebody was complaining about um, she sees it on her story, you know, for like a whole week. I thought it was like Instagram and Snapchat where it goes away in 24 hours. So next time I will make a short and freaking either just post it as a regular video or make it a short and not a story. Like, I didn't know how it was supposed to go. But when I hit 50K... I would definitely be doing a um, giveaway because right now we're at 47,853 so I mean we still got a little ways to go but I'm like we further than what we was like when I first moved here so I'm like I'm happy of that and you know people still um, mess with me you know even though my uh, you know I'm like I don't really I mean I post on my I don't post like every day and you know stuff like that like I should. I never check my mailbox. So yeah, and I'm like I'm glad you know companies are still reaching out to me because I'm just like I feel like you know my even though I still have you know my power or whatever inside of the YouTube world, you know I feel like damn, well, y'all still you know. Y'all still messing with me, and I'm like, I'm not even, um, I don't feel like I'm, you know, banging like I used to, you know? But I'm like, it's still a good feeling, so I'm just like, I'll accept that. Girl, I'm literally about to stop ordering clothes, too. Like, I really want to, um, like, I'm going to still mess with Shane. Like, I'm waiting on the order now, and, like, some of the stuff I do want, but then sometimes I just be getting stuff just so I can make videos for y'all. But I think that... Um, I think I'm going to, um, start posting my clothes and stuff like that and selling them because I do got like two or three pairs of heels that's coming and I'm not a big, big heel person so I'm like I do not have an arch in my foot. I'm more of a platform type person that I can walk in and I'm just like I don't feel like I need to have a bunch of shoes and clothes if I'm really not going to wear them. But I say that now, but I'm like, I'll buy all this stuff or get this stuff for free and keep it in my closet because I'm just like, even though I only wore it one time for the video, I felt like I should keep it because I never know 
when I'm gonna go somewhere and that dress that's sitting in my closet could be somewhere, you know, I'm like, it can be something that I wanna wear for a special occasion or something. I'm not buying more clothes so I get to my desired weight. Girl, that's why I feel like I'm about to have like, the more weight I lose, even though, you know, I'm like, it's probably nothing to y'all, but I'm like, it's something to me. Um, I'm just gonna be having all these big clothes. I'm just like, I don't know when or like to buy stuff. Like right now, I can be like, oh my God, like this is too big. And y'all be like, uh-uh, girl, that's your right size. And I be like, no, literally, like it feels hella freaking big. Just like the, um, that little four, hey, come to me, that little four dress tone that I had the last one that y'all said I should keep that as a house dress. When I wore that to freaking to get my hair done, girl, it just felt like a big ass fucking blanket. And I was just like, damn, like I literally walked in, like I was about to drop my kids off to school to their hair appointment. I was gonna go back to bed. Like that's how I felt. So I'm like, that's why I wore the shorts underneath it. And then when I sat in the chair, you know, I'm like I kind of, you know, like rolled up the shirt and like, you know, like scratched it up. You know, so like, okay, I do got something on here. Like this is not no house moo you know like it made me feel kind of um you know people just be walking out the house looking all kind of crazy and stuff but i mean it was a cute crazy but i'm like it was a little too crazy you know what i mean so i was just like mm, yeah but other than that i'm gonna see Girl, and the thing is about that, I have too many night clothes. Like, I have a whole bunch of, um, Joy Spun and, what's the other one? Secret Treasures on top of freaking Sheen night clothes. I got a lot. And I keep washing the ones that I wear, and I'm like, I haven't made it to the bottom of the drawer yet. So I'm just like, I need to start wearing my other ones. I don't want to get on this girl's taco for the doctor. Girl, me either. Hey, you guys. Hey, you guys. So, yeah, that's my whole, my whole little thing. But, I think I am going to get off here so that way I could go um, take a shower, do my makeup. So, at least I can do one part of the video and sitting there till I'm just like, oh, yeah, sponsor this. I'm just like, baby, I want to get paid. You know, you know what I mean? And I'm going to New Orleans in um, August for my friend's birthday. So I'm just like, baby, I need to be saving my coins. I'm like, I already bought my ticket. But, you know, I need, to, I need to have some play money. You need to have some play money, and then you need to have your rainy day money. And I'm like, I'm not about to touch my rainy day money, so. Yeah. So that's where we at right now. Um. Yeah, I was like, I'm going to try to run back and watch the first part live. Hey, Mo. Girl, yeah, I pretty much prepped everything so that way you wouldn't be a super long live. Because I know y'all be like, damn come back and the person's still cooking. No, I try to prep everything that I can possibly uh, wear. Wear a belt with the dress on. Um, you know what, I don't even have any, um, I don't even have any belts. And I'm also trying to get into, thank you boo. I'm trying to get into like, um, more shoes. Like I need to go, matter of fact, I need to go shoe shopping for real. And, I want to get into, uh, what is that thing called? Um, it's something to do with clothes. I really forgot. Uh, dang, what is it? As soon as she said that, it messed me up. I don't know, I'm trying to get into something, but I forgot what it was. It got something to do with, like, clothes and fashion. Dang, I forgot. 
Dang. Watch when I get up from here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna remember it. But y'all, I did go to Dollar Tree the other day, and I'm like, I did have some, um, I did have a rose out there that I had bought from like off the street, you know, like you sit in your car and people be on the side of the road or whatever. And I was just like, you know what? Let me start a Dollar Tree because I haven't went to Home Depot yet to go like uh, shopping for like, you know, like flower sets or pocket. But I bought these pretty flowers and I put them in my vase outside. And so this is outside my door and I just used the marbles from my house uh, that was in my bathroom. Um, and they sure know was right there. And I just put them outside. Look how cute is that? I was going to do like some 4th of July colors, but I'm just like, girl, 4th of July will be here and gone. And then I'm going to have to buy new flowers. So I'm like, I can really keep them colors all summer long. And then when the winter time comes, I can just change those flowers and go buy like some orange ones, some browns, you know, some yellows or something. Shoot, we can recycle them flowers. But yeah, let me get off here so I can go take a shower and at least I do my makeup or something. Um, but you know, first I'm going to have to clean up my kitchen because I'm not going to be with no very kitchen like that. Oh, freaking no. Get the stretch belt she wants so I fit fall down with the belt. Okay, I'm going to have to look some up. And I was looking at um, Sheen because Sheen has like a $10 clearing sale and... They literally have like shirts for like $5, um, shorts, jeans, like everything that seems like it's under $20. I only got through a couple um, pages and I don't know, we might have to do a tour haul. But I'm like, like I said, like I got too many clothes. So we gonna have to see. Unless I'm gonna just buy the clothes and I'm gonna have to turn around and sell them because I got way too many clothes. I feel like I'm not shopping myself. So if y'all see me come up with a website and sell my clothes, I'm not even gonna charge for the clothes. I'm really just about to be like, here, $25 or whatever. And it's just gonna, I'm gonna just say including shipping. Cause I'm like, I don't know how to price clothes and everything like that. I just need y'all to pay for the shipping. Like y'all can have the clothes, you know what I mean? So yeah. But yeah, let me get off here if I can finish cleaning my kitchen. I gotta clean the griddle, wash these dishes right here, and put the other ones up that I've washed. And find something to cook tonight for tomorrow. I don't know, he can eat cereal tomorrow. I ain't gotta cook. I'll cook Monday. Shoot. Fend for yourself Sunday. <gasps> Who has the missing your thing? I got the ring app and a lot of people just be missing dogs over here. I'm like, what in the world? Y'all don't keep your dogs in the house or on the freaking leash. I don't know, y'all, but let me get off here and um, do what I gotta do. Hopefully, I will see y'all next week in a video. Um, if y'all don't get no video from me Monday, that means I'm still waiting on um, Timu's approval. Well, not really approval. Maybe I really just be sending them the link so they can see that I did the video. They like it and I'll be waiting for my payment. Um, yeah, but if not, then Thursday morning when I get off, then that's when I'll start my vlogging and probably go and... Um, my little self-care day or something like that i think you know i need to you know go do like a little activity you know probably go take a little morning walk when i get off um might go to rainbows and you know just look you know i am going to trip on this like i do need some um sandals like i said we're doing the color orange so i'm like i still need to you know you know find a little outfit for that and 
I don't know. It's something else that I seen, but I'm like, it's gonna be a surprise. I ain't even gonna tell y'all. But yeah. Um. So y'all have a good night. Make sure y'all go to the a smash burger with bacon. And I will see y'all when I see you. Say they love you. And thank you for cooking with me today. So everybody have a good night. Don't forget to like this video. Make sure y'all go vote for Dee Dee. Um, and shoot. Run this video back while you clean it up or something. Because, yeah. That's what we need to do. So y'all have a good night, everybody. Okay, bye.